hello guys welcome to my channel so i think you are trying to restart your pc or just simply shut it down but unfortunately you got this screen and it is too long still not changing anything then you are watching the right video i'm sure you are going to fix it very soon i'm going to consider multiple situation and going to suggest you appropriate method to solve it so if you are getting this screen on your pc it may be your laptop or desktop which is showing getting windows ready don't turn off your computer then first of all i want to suggest you please wait at least two hours and maximum 3 hours even after 3 hours if nothing changes then follow my step to fix it i am suggesting you to wait because windows may be doing something in background and it needs some time to complete it and it will just show like this windows getting ready don't turn off your computer but anyway if it is too long then let's fix it so first thing you should do forcefully shut down your computer by pressing and holding the power button for few seconds you should hold the power button until all the light goes off. After that normally start your computer just by pressing the power button. There is little chance that your PC may get started without any problem. But if nothing changes then forcefully shut it down by pressing and holding the power button again. And after that again start it normally and this time when you will see any light on your screen instantly press and hold your power button to forcefully shut it down. And after that again start it normally and again when you see any light on your display again forcefully shut it down by pressing and holding the power button. After doing like this two or three times in the third or fourth attempts you will see this on your computer screen. When you will see this on your computer screen wait until you get this screen. From here before going to advanced option I will suggest you please restart your computer just by pressing this restart button. There is also little chance that the issue may get fixed and your PC may get started normally. Please note that restarting your computer and normally starting it after shutting it down are different things. So after clicking on restart your computer if it is showing the same things windows getting ready then wait until 10 minutes and if it is it starts showing up something like 2% completed 10% completed then wait until it gets completed 100%. But if it is not showing anything other than windows getting ready don't turn off your computer you can come to this option just by following the same steps i have shown you forcefully shutting down your computer two or three times and from here go to advanced option and from here go to troubleshoot and again go to advanced option and from here open the command prompt and now from here by the help of a command we'll check and find if any critical file exists in our computer and we'll delete that to fix the issue. So first of all we need to be in the C directory so for that type C then colon then hit on enter you'll be in the C directory by now. After that type CD then space then windows slash system32 slash log file slash SRT dot please type the exactly same command whatever you can see on the screen and after that hit on enter. Then SRT trail txt hit on enter. So after running the command if it find any critical files in your computer then it will show something like this. It will show the directory where the critical file exists and it will show the name of the file and that's what we need to fix this issue. So to fix the issue we need to delete that critical file. So for that type cd and type the exactly same location where it is located. In my case as you can see it is uh, at c windows system 32 driver. So I am going to type the exactly same way how it is showing. So you can see I have typed windows system 32 drivers. And after that hit on enter and you will be in this folder drivers folder where it is located. So after that type del and after that type the name and in my case as you can see the name of that critical file is bsoc.says. So I need to type that exactly same name and after that hit on enter and that file that critical file will be deleted and that's it or issue will be get fixed. So guys I hope that will be enough to fix the issue but if it is still not fixed then I will suggest you three more methods. First one is try by startup repair. If you want to know how to do startup repair you can watch my video link is in the description. But after doing that if the issue is still not fixed you can try by reinstalling the windows and while doing so you can keep your file. No file will be deleted if you don't want. And to know how to reinstall the windows you can watch my video link is in the description. You can also try by system restore. To know how to do system restore you can watch my video link is in the description. So that's it for this video guys if you have any question or confusion then please comment that in the comment section I'll replay back soon. And if you feel this video is helpful for you then please help me back by leaving a nice comment in the comment section and hitting on the like button and please stay connected by subscribing this channel. So thank you for watching this video please keep supporting this channel. So goodbye see you soon in the next video.